<laughs> hey y'all this is Jan and Kevin and we're gonna do a video on how to make uh what's it called they're green chili chicken enchiladas yes that <laughs> so here we go hope you're having a great day okay so what we're gonna start with is I took three chicken, three and a half chicken breasts, and I shredded it. And you mix it with sour cream. I put Mrs. Dash in it. I put some Grill Master garlic, uh, roasted garlic and herb, and garlic powder. And I cut up probably, I have small garlic, so I cut up like 10 garlic cloves and diced them and put them in here. And then the other thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add jalapenos, chopped jalapenos in this. And um, you just mix that up. And then once that's mixed up, you're gonna take it over to your pan that you've already sprayed with some oil. And you're just gonna layer it. You can double layer it like this. And you're gonna put your tortillas on there. I get the big ones. I don't like the little ones. So, and then, um, well, I'm going to use my hands because I like to use my hands. And then you just spread some shredded chicken around here and just, it doesn't have to be like all over the place because you're going to have a lot of layers. And then you're going to wash your hands off. <laughs> and you'll have some cheddar cheese. And then we get... Let me see if I can get it open. Uh, we have a store called H-E-B and they sell, sell green chili stew. And I was telling you in the other video, you can like so probably make that yourself. A lot cheaper um, but I I just haven't ever really looked to see how to do it um, I know it's tomatillos and jalapenos and things like that so I'm probably gonna use this whole pack of cheese so I'm just gonna cut it open and I used let me see I used uh, 24 ounces of sour cream and then so once you get the chicken on there you just layer it I like a lot of cheese so I'm just gonna layer it with cheese and then I'm gonna pour the stew green chili stew over it and you can just mix it in with your hands. And then I'm just gonna repeat, I'm just gonna keep repeating this um, until I run out of chicken. Hold on, I gotta get some more tortillas. And we'll probably make about three layers of this. And then you cook it, you preheat your oven at 350. And cook it for, golly, just maybe about 30 minutes. It doesn't take long. You know, because basically all you're doing is melting the cheese. Now, on this next layer, I always do more chicken. I do a lot more chicken. Because we're only going three layers. So you want to have that middle layer, like, just full. And then, again, we're going to repeat it. Um, I'm going to tell you that master, what is it, masterpiece, uh, oh no, grill works, garlic, roasted, gosh. It's roasted McCormick's. Garlic. Yes, garlic and herb, you can use that on just about anything. It's awesome with your vegetables. It's awesome with your, really good with your chicken and pork. I mean, we use 
the McCormick's on a lot of stuff. And it is so yummy, y'all. You just got to try it. Um, you know, I'm sure people say you can make your own, but um, I haven't got there yet. So now I'm going to put a lot of this on the middle. I'm going to actually use the last of the jar. And you just spread it around and repeat. And this will be our last layer of uh, the enchiladas. And then the other thing we're having for supper is, you want to get those out of the fridge, is some um, jalapeno poppers. We're going to grill those. Because you're having a Mexican dinner, you might as well have jalapeno poppers. We <clears throat> like our jalapenos and we like our spicy food. We live in Texas, so even though we're both Yankees, <laughs> we like hot food. <laughs> we actually generally make these ourselves. Yeah, today I bought them. I was lazy. We have company. My daughter and granddaughter are on their way. And honestly, I was just being lazy. Okay, I have to get my other jar. Uh, the other great thing about the green chili sauce um, is you can actually, I'm going to put the green chili sauce on now instead of last and then coat it with the top layer of cheese. Um, what was I going to say? Well, I just totally lost my train of thought. Anyway, um, this is just such a delicious meal, and you will really, really, really like it. I suggest trying it and oh then I know what I was gonna say the other thing is um, when you have if you have leftover green chili stew you can use it for like a salsa um, you know a dip it's really good so now we're just gonna put this in the oven so no tortillas on top no tortillas on top just the cheese and the green chili stew. <clears throat> We're going to put this in the oven for a half hour. And when we're done, since I don't know how to pause my video or edit or anything yet, um, we'll show you the jalapeno poppers. And we'll show you the end result of the enchiladas. So stay tuned. We'll be back. 